Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I have such an exciting video for you guys today because it is the most anticipated video of, of the year. year. Well, we are going to be doing my oh, What I Got For Christmas 2019. Now, I just want to first off point out that I am in fact ill. I am the most congested, snottiest mess right now and it is not cute. So if I sound super nasally then that is just a pre-warning but I wasn't holding off on filming this video any longer. I'm sick, I'm here, but I'll film this video for you guys because I'd hate to leave it till like January because it's pointless by the time it gets January. No one wants to see what you got for Christmas by the time it gets January. So I'm here, I'm uploading it now and I'm also going to get rid of these hands because I feel like they're very annoying. <laughs> but yeah, usual disclaimer, I am not trying to show off and be like, oh my God, look all the stuff I got because that's just not me whatsoever. I just purely do this for your guys' entertainment. And just because I really enjoy watching these videos, I'm such a nosy person and I love to see what people have got for Christmas. So if you guys are the same, then hopefully this is a fun little vid for you to watch. But I'm gonna hop on into the little gifts I got this Christmas. Can I just say how like exciting it is to actually give people presents? Because this morning when I went down with all the gifts of people, I was way more excited to give them their gifts and watch their reaction than me to actually open mine. I don't know if that's just like part of growing up or what, but I really prefer to watch people open their gifts than open gifts myself. But I'm gonna shut up and I'm gonna show you the stuff that I got because there are some cute little things in this video to show you. I guess we'll start off big with my main present. I can't even speak properly right now. This is literally gonna be torture. If you guys watched my Christmas wishlist video, you guys will see that I put this in there because I don't currently have a speaker which works. So I wanted a nice, good quality speaker to, you know, put some tunes on when I get ready and things like that. I am so sorry if my voice gets really irritated and I literally cannot do a single thing about it. But I did get the JBL Flip 5 grey Bluetooth speaker. I don't know all the technical things about this. I just know that Jack has this in black and it is the best speaker ever. So I wanted it in grey because I thought it was a nice colour and plus it's easy because we're not going to get mixed up with whose is whose. So this was my main present and I'm honestly so gassed to use this. You don't understand how long I waited and wanted to have a good quality speaker. Best believe I would be using the hell out of this come New Year's. And then I got an actual essential, like I get these every Christmas because I literally go through them like no tomorrow. They get so discolored, they get lost, they get tight. So I have a new pack of fresh, clean Nike white socks, which honestly makes me the happiest because these, when you have a fresh tan, it's honestly the prettiest thing ever. I know that sounds so stupid and dumb, but it makes you just look so put together and I love it. And having new socks with new trainers is genuinely the best feeling in the world. So speaking of that, I'll move on to the trainers that I got. Again, if you guys did watch my wishlist video, you will know that I asked for a new sort of colorway in the night zoom 2k's i think that's what they're called but these are honestly the comfiest shoe i wore mine to death like they're in such a state right now i don't even have them up here to show you but just believe me when i say they look disgusting so a new nice pair was uh definitely overdue i know these aren't gonna be everyone's cup of tea but they just look like this they are the nicest most white i don't know if they're the white the cream kind of the best shoe i've ever owned in my life they do so many different colorways of this but i saw this one which has like the lime green on and i fell in love so i was like I'm gonna pop that on my Christmas list and I got it, which I'm so, so, so happy about. I just cannot wait to get these on my feet and wear these because it's gonna be so nice to have a nice, fresh, clean pair that don't look super disgusting with all my outfits. So yeah, love those. And then I got literally like an essential in everyone's day-to-day -day life. It is an electric toothbrush. This is the Black Oral-B one. I think this just looks so like sleek. I don't know why. I feel like this is just it's a really nice toothbrush and I'm so excited to use this because I've actually used a manual toothbrush for the longest time and I've never really, you know, dabbled in the electric toothbrush area, I guess you'd call it, I don't really know. I'm really excited to try this out and I think it's a snazzy little brush. And then I got this set which honestly looks fab. I've never seen this before but my mum got me it in my stocking and honestly it looks pretty pretty cool and it is the there she glows st moritz tan set so you get one of the original sort of st moritz tanners you get a brush and then you also get a bronzing powder which i thought like this is such a cute little like trio for any fake tan gals out there and yeah i'm really excited to use this you can never have enough st moritz honestly so cheap so good bloody love the stuff and to have it in a little gift set is fab and the fact it comes with a makeup brush, I actually use a makeup brush on my chest and on my face with fake tan. So having one actually dedicated to that is going to be perfect. So I don't have to ruin all my other makeup brushes, covering them all in tan. So yeah, very, very, very happy about that. And then I got a little candle set, which honestly looks so festive. It is adorable. And it's kind of like a little tree with four, five, six, seven, eight 
eight little Christmas candles. This is from Wickford and Co. But there is so many scents in this. There's like candy cane, gingerbread, vanilla sugar cookies, frosted sugar plum. Oh my god, I'm so excited to like these. Honestly, could not care less that I'm going to be using these after Christmas because these scents are genuinely my favourite. <sighs> mm. Best believe my room be smelling good with these candles. Yes. And then, of course, who doesn't love getting alcohol at Christmas? I got this gin and candle set, which is so cute. I've never seen anything like this before. It is just a little bottle of the Palmer Violets gin, and then it also comes with the matching candle. But I'm literally going to be stocked up on alcohol and candles until probably next Christmas, so love that. Then I got a new, nice, fresh set of Real Techniques makeup brushes. Honestly, can never have enough of these. They're genuinely the best price for drugstore brushes. And this one just comes with five, yeah, little brushes. There's a few eye ones and a couple face ones. And I'm very excited to use these. And then this, oh my God, it is so cute. It's basically a little sort of glitter bauble. And it has the miniature babe power spray from Misguided, which I already have the big size of and I love. So the fact I have a little travel one for my bag is the best. And it also comes with a little pink pom-pom keyring as well for my keys. This is like the perfect little set. And I'm not even going to lie, I'm going to keep this case and put it on my tree next year because it fits the theme. And why not, you know, recycling, all that fun stuff. Something you guys know I'm obsessed with is Dr. Paw Paw Lip Balms and my mum popped this in my stocking. It is the little trio of them so it has the original yellow one, they have a sort of like nude one and then the peach one which I'm so excited to use these because I've only ever used the yellow one and I just love that, honestly swear by it. But I'm very excited to try some new little scents and colours. Oh my god you can use this on like your cheeks and everything, I don't even know that. Fun. And then I got another pack of Nike socks. These are actually different to the ones I usually get, but they look pretty fun. They basically just say like Nike on the sort of ankle bit, I guess. And then they have the tick on the foot, and this is just a little black and white pair. So cute little pack there. Sticking on the theme of Nike, I got this, which I swear is a tradition. I've had this for the past like two years. I know I definitely got them last year, but they are the Nike Pro Shorts. These are the comfiest things ever. I literally just wear them with hoodies, which is kind of bad because they're literally like the itty bittiest shorts in the world. But if you don't have a butt, they make your butt look so freaking good, which I appreciate a lot. I'm very excited to wear these. These are actually kind of different to the ones I got last year, so that is fun. And then I got some hair care. So I got this Tony and Guy Turn Up The Boost little gift set and it has a amplifying something hairspray illuminated hair perfume a shampoo a conditioner and a couple little bobbles which is going to be very helpful because my hair is pretty dead from all the heat so it's going to be nice to treat to some good little products and hopefully they will improve my hair make it look sleek and shiny and all that good stuff and then from my mama and my dad, and I'll keep saying mum, you guys know by now it means mum and dad, but mum always has all the input. This is the, oh my god, I sound so nasally. But this is the Vera Wang Flower Princess Spray. Honestly, this comes in the cutest little bottle ever. I've actually properly opened this yet, so I'll show you it now. Honestly, really sad that I'm not going to be able to smell this because literally my nose just doesn't work right now. I will show you nonetheless if I can actually get into it with these huge ass nails. But I mean, this is honestly like the fattest bottle of perfume. It's 100ml and it is a cute little sort of glass heart and it has a little silver tiara on top. Honestly, love this. It is the prettiest thing ever and I feel like when you just sit stuff like this out on like your dressing table or your desk or anything it looks super cute and I'm very very excited to wear this like I said so sad I can't smell this right now but I already know that it smells good just unfortunately can't right now literally nothing can't smell a thing and then from Jack's mum I got this cute little face mask set literally everyone knows how obsessed I am with face masks and it is a cute little hamper of the seventh heaven face masks and it also comes with a little loofah and a bath bomb as well which i didn't even notice so that is super cute but there's like coconut dead sea charcoal cucumber and just just a bunch of fun face masks in there so i'm pretty much stocked up for the rest of my life basically with face masks and that makes me so happy because you can never have enough they're just so fun got that from jack's mum and then she also got me the cutest little hot chocolate set which i'm so excited to use because these flavors sound incredible it's a little sort of gift box and it has cookie flavored hot chocolate gingerbread french vanilla salted caramel caramel marsh mellow peppermint mocha chocolate and cherry and double chocolate hot chocolate is one of my favorite things to drink i don't mind tea i'm not a huge coffee drinker but hot chocolate is like 
mummy and bitch I love a lot and I'm very excited to try all these flavors and again matching with the nails very festive very fun I love it honestly I'm trying to show you as much as I can but I don't want this video to be a million and one minutes long so I'm trying my best to um, get through them without seeming ungrateful I don't want to be like rushing through like oh, got this got this got this but like it's kind of hard you know I don't want to have you sitting here hours watching this so i will show you a few things my grandma and granddad got me because they got some cute little stuff i ain't gonna lie so the first off got me the victoria's secret endless love body lotion ever since i started fit tanning pretty much like more than a bit years ago now i have loved having loads of body lotions because it feels so nice after you've washed off your fit tan to lather on a thick body lotion it just feels the best and it keeps your tan from going all crusty dusty but honestly this is one of my favorite scents i have this spray in this and it literally smells like the strongest most fruitiest shampoo in the world like you know that sort of holiday smell i can't really describe it but yeah that's what this smells like it is incredible and a few can love it and then they also got me a bit of makeup which is bougie so i got the fenty beauty sunstalker instant warmth bronzer in the shade private island and this is honestly the nicest if I can get it open, warm tone bronzer because a lot of my bronzers sometimes make me look super muddy but this is honestly like the perfect colour <sighs> look at that and Fenty Beauty packaging in itself is literally just like a dream like it's all gold and mirrored it is so bougie and fancy but I love it and I'm so excited to get that on my face thank you very much and then I also got the Fenty Beauty Pro Kisser Luscious Lip Balm and this is in Hint Hint Genuinely, when I saw this, I was like, wow, like, hello, because it is in the prettiest packaging ever. But it basically just looks like a regular sort of squeezy tube of lip balm, but then you open it like this and it has a little doff applicator on. Hello, best invention ever. And this is going to be so nice to wear when I don't want to, you know, have like anything super like sticky and disgusting on my lips. I can just pop on this and it's going to be perfect. And then the last makeup bit they got was the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist, which, <coughs> pardon me, I've wanted this for the longest time because when everyone uses it in their videos, it just looks so cool how it's literally just like, yeah, it is a huge ass bottle as well. And I'm just so excited to use this. It basically comes in like a hairspray can for your face, but it's apparently a really good setting mist, so I'm very excited to try this out. And then, of course, if you didn't watch my gift swap video with Jack, then you wouldn't know, but he actually got me my favourite, favourite, favourite perfume ever, which is Gucci Flora. But again, it is like the classiest little bottle, and this is going to be like my special perfume. I'm going to be so super limited on how much of this I use because it is not cheap, and yeah love this thank you again i've said it about a thousand times but honestly love this stuff and then this is also from jack i kind of didn't really go into depth of what this was in my gift swap video because i was just super emotional i couldn't really get my words together but he basically got me the vivian westwood gold necklace which i wanted for so so long it's actually a joke and it is the prettiest cried my eyes out if you've not yet seen already and you can't really see it that well in this lighting but it's a gorgeous sort of gold glittery vivian westwood pendant on the end of the gold chain it is gorgeous, it is beautiful, but it's basically everything I've ever wanted in a necklace and I genuinely couldn't be happy with this and I love it so bloody much. So yeah, if you have not yet seen my gift swap video with Jack, then I will link it down below because I was pretty emotional in that video, I'm not gonna lie, but yeah love that and then he picked me up a pack of fluffy socks which i'm actually sporting right now they are so super cute <laughs> love those and then this i was generally so shocked with but he actually got me the huda beauty new nude palette which is the prettiest thing i've ever seen in my life like look at all the glitter and oh my god just oh. It's literally a palette of perfect shades. I'm so excited to try this out. And this is basically a gorgeous nude palette. And then these huge chunky glitters, which I'm very excited to get on my eyelids. These are going to be perfect for New Year's Eve. Like, literal. Ha! Ah, yes. And then if you've not yet seen already, these unfortunately are out of stock now. But he got me the Selfridges Ultimate Mask Collection, I think it's called. And basically, it's literally a little binder full of every mask you would ever need in your life. Like, there's lip masks, foot masks, face masks, every mask. It is perfect. And then he just got me the little God's Plans notebook, which I'm very excited to use. It's just got a little book of Drake's heads, which you guys know I love Drake. Pretty self-explanatory. 
And then I got some little skincare. So I got this cute little simple mini regime sort of bag. And it comes with the moisturising facial wash, the hydrating light moisturiser, and the micellar cleansing water. But they're all in like little bags. I think that's so cute and I'm very excited to use these. And then I got the cutest gifts from Tara. So the first thing is this, which is a mug which says all you need is love and chocolate, which honestly could not be more accurate. And then it also comes with some Oreos and a vanilla flavoured hot drink, which genuinely is my weakness. I cannot wait to have all the hot chocolates and everything warm and just ugh, in the world literal heaven so love that and then she picked me up this lip palette which actually looks really fun it's the bella pierre 12 color pro matte lip palette honestly love this every time i go into primark i look for this spray and i never have it in stock and i was talking about it to tara when we were in primark one time and she managed to find it and pick it up for me and it is the ps mink perfume one of the nicest smelling perfumes and for the price you can't not beat it it is amazing and it is in a really cute bottle as well it's all like sleek and gray like it's in this super glossy little gray bottle and i think it is so cute again not even gonna be able to smell it but i already know it smells good and this will be a nice little everyday perfume bloody love this stuff and then the final thing she got me is honestly the cutest thing ever you guys know i love my gold jewelry so she picked me up this oh my god i love it little gold necklace in the shape of a bunny rabbit and then it has a little heart cut out in the center and if you guys don't already know i recently well i say recently a couple months ago got a bunny rabbit we now have two and they're honestly the sweetest fluffiest cutest most adorable little animals in the world which i think is the sweetest little most thoughtful present ever so thank you honestly i can't even remember what i have shown and what i haven't shown if i have missed things out i am so sorry but i did not want this video to be so super long so i try my best to show you guys as much as physically possible that was it for this christmas haul i hope you guys did enjoy it and i hope you had the best christmas ever and please 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 don't like compare your gifts to other people because i used to do that so much when i was younger and it used to get me like really down in the dumps i was like why can't i have these things why have they got these things and all things like that everyone's christmas is different it is not about the presents guys you already know this by now wow i don't think you can take it seriously because my nose <laughs> But genuinely, just spending time with your loved ones is the best thing about Christmas. Eat loads of good food, listen to some good music, fill your face with chocolate, get it drunk. It's honestly the best. So yeah, don't think like too deep into things. At the end of the day, this is all just like materialistic things and no one needs this stuff to be happy. But it's just a kind little gesture for Christmas. I don't know why I got so deep there at the end. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this and I will see you in my next video. Bye. S O S never guess cuz I know mama told me that I'm blessed but he never on the show get impressed cuz I'm dope you don't smoke what you mean keep it potent as the green so you know this happy tree